We break up and you slam the door I messed up on the bedroom floor What the hell? What's up y'all? Welcome back to the channel. Hey cousins, how y'all doing? I was getting ready to run out for an appointment but I decided to make this really quick video because I was amazed at what this little thing and I'm gonna tell you in a minute <clears throat> can do this is let me just tell you about this unit this is a synthetic wig it was wig wash day so I just washed it um, with some Shea Moisture daily shampoo um, and I conditioned the hair overnight with silicone mix I rinsed it out this morning and I blew it dry so um, initially it did not have this level of body to it until I use this Tymo. It's called a Tymo. It's almost like a straightening comb brush, if you will. So this is it. <clears throat> this is not a sponsored video, but I purchased this. I think I saw it on like YouTube or um, TikTok or something. And I was like, yeah, that's pretty cool because I love a straightening comb, but this just puts an additional spin on a straightening comb. So, um, get my hair out of here. <laughs> I use this on my natural hair as well as on my wigs. If you want to make quick work of flat ironing and straightening your wigs, this is it, baby. And I'm going to show you just how quick I'm going to go through this unit. Um, it has a power button. It has one, two, three, look like six settings. Um, right now I have it on... I have it on three based on the package for this particular wig it can go up to 400 degrees the only downside is it doesn't tell you what the degrees are so who knows what level four number level five who knows what those are but typically a typical flat iron goes up to like 400 450 at the most I haven't seen anything hotter than that if I were to compare it let me see does this one even have it on there? <laughs> All right, yeah. So this is my curling iron. And um, for example, medium is 350. High is 400. The max is 450. So I'm just kind of using that as a guide. Timo, if you want to kind of improve on the product, two recommendations. Put the number as far as the heat degrees next to the actual uh, light indicator and put a lock on the handle because I find myself sometimes like turning it off or turning the degrees up because it's right here on the handle. But other than that, it's beautiful. It comes in pink and it comes in black with the pink outline, which is what I chose. But anyway, this is not a review specifically about the product, even though that was a high level. Um, it's about what it can do. So again, this is a synthetic unit. Um, I'm gonna show you how quickly look at that. Can y'all see that? And I just do this front and back. Now it did come with some heat gloves. I recommend you use it because it definitely gets hot. Almost like, I think I could compare this to the heat that is in a curling wand. Um, it's, it's pretty high heat. But once you get it through, you see how those strands are going through there? Look at that. And this is a synthetic wig. Okay. Oh goodness. So the time that it would take you to flat iron this wig is cut down or any wig, your hair, the wig. I Like I said, I use it on my hair.
Try to do a little bit of the bang piece up here. Let that cool off before I brush it down. <laughs> but would you look at that? It's almost like it's brand new, like how I got it out the pack. Look at that. When I say it straightens, and I honestly I was gonna throw this wig away. Um it's my only synthetic wig at this point. And it's kind of like my running errand wig. But we didn't brought her back to life. I'm just going to bump the ends. But if you can see, look at that. And it definitely would have took me longer if I was trying to flat iron it. You don't have the crimps. That the flat iron would, would leave. You don't have those. Woo, it does get hot though. Be mindful. It does get hot. So make sure you're using those gloves or some bath gloves. I'm keeping it away from my face because of course, due to the heat. And it was like super rough at the ends. The hair was super rough at the ends and this just completely smoothed it out. And there we go. All right, y'all, for more, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe. Please make sure that you follow me. Hit that notification bell so that you can know when I upload a new video. And I'll see you next time right here on Shy Solo Life. Bye, cousins.